What's percolating YouTube? It's your boy, Best Superstar, and we back with another Couch with Trash. And this is gonna be number six. So if you've been rocking with me since episode one, I appreciate you. If you're just now finding the series, I appreciate you. Hopefully, I grab your interest and you keep coming back every week. Now, I normally do these on Mondays, but it's Wednesday now, so I'm kind of late, but nothing really came out yesterday, so we all good. And if you like the video, leave that thumbs up. If you dislike the video, leave a thumbs down. Comment down below if you're looking forward to any of these shoes. Share the video, subscribe, tell a friend, tell another friend, tell another friend to subscribe. So we on the road to 1K. And let's get into it. Now, on the 12th, we had the noise canceling pack from Nike and Jordan brand. From Nike side, we had the Air Force One Low and then the Nike Cortez. Um, I'm just gonna say both of those is trash. And then the Jordan side, we have the Air Jordan 1. I mean, out of those three, the Jordan 1 is the best one. I mean, it's an all white shoe. And the retail is 110. Like, and it looks like a hot, I don't, I don't know. But um, the Jordan 1 for 110, that's all white. And I need some white shoes. I mean, I don't know. I don't know if they sold out. I don't know if they are reselling for anything, but I don't know. I might have to take that out. I might have to cop because I do, I, I do need some white shoes. So, um, and then also on the 14th, we got the Nike Air Force One high collab with Emotionally Unavailable. Now, I'm pretty sure I talked about these two weeks ago as well. Um, I don't know why these shoes keep getting pushed back. Also for Nike, we got the Nike Kyrie 5 Duke colorway. Uh, I'm a Tar Heel fan, so you already know that's trash. Then from the Jordan side, we got the Jordan Apex Utility. Um, I honestly don't like that shoe, so I'm gonna go ahead and say that bit trash. And then we got the Jordan Why Not 0.2 OKC Home. I like the shoe, but this colorway is just an OKC Home colorway. It ain't nothing spectacular. But whoever is on the design team, and marketing team or that whatever they doing with this shoe, I applaud them. I still gotta get the All Star shoe. Um, and the the Valentine's Day one they had was fire with the with the, the box, the Super Soakers. Um, what was the other one? It was another one. But anyways, all them shits is fire and all the packaging is fire. I like the shoe. So hopefully I can get the All Star one. I don't I don't think they sold. I think they still on Nike. So hopefully they go on sale. Because um, the basketball season is coming up and I need some hooping shoes, so I might give those a try. On the 15th, we got the Aaliyah May, Ali May, however you say her name, forgive me. But um, she got the Jordan 6, and I haven't seen one of her shoes yet that I have not liked. So, congrats to you. Keep on doing what you're doing, because you were putting out some fun shit. I ain't even go to uh, From the Nike side on the 15th, we got some Nike LeBron low 16s. Um, I don't know what kind of colorway this is, but these shit's trash. And then we got the Nike React Element 55. It like got some gold, some silver, and some copper on it. Um, I like the React Elements, the 55s and, and the 87s. Um, but this colorway, like if you took off the, the copper stripe on the back, probably is cash. Um, I'm not gonna say it's trash. I feel like they're doing too much with it. Like if they want to do like a, a metal pack, just make three different shoes like I've been doing forever. Like don't put them all on one shoe. But that's just my opinion. And then we got the Air, uh, the Air Max 95. That's trash, it's just a basic shoe. We got the Nike Air Vapor Max 2.0 Swarovski. Um, retail for 100, you heard them every time they put them crystals in that thing, that price gonna go up. And this is actually a men's shoe. Normally when they do the, um, Swar uh, the Swarovski collab, it's normally on women's shoes. But for them to do on a men's shoe, um, I don't know how many men are gonna buy shoes that got crystals in them, but it's a lime green shoe. So I don't know, good luck selling that. I'm gonna say that'd be a trash. On the 16th from Jordan Brand, we got the Air Jordan Wine. Wine, what the fuck is wine? 
Air Jordan 1 Retro High OG in the Phantom colorway. Now it looked like the Platinum Tint 11s to me, but um, which I still don't have. So, um, I mean, I don't know, like they, they clean. I like how it's different. Like you know they keep dropping Jordan 1 models all year. They're like different. Like some aspect of it is different. You like you never see a different color stitching on the Jordan 1. So for them to do that in red and they choose like a cream sale color, it looks like I got like three different color whites on here. But um I think it's dope. I'm, I'm gonna say it's cash. I'm gonna say it's cash. And then also on the 16 we got the frog skateboards and Nike Blazers. Like like I said in the previous, I was blazer gang in high school and they starting to bring out some fire heat for the for the um blazers. I mean like if I can get my hands on those, I don't know where Frog Skateboards is, and I don't skateboard, but the shoe itself is five to me, so I'm just gonna say that's cash. Also on 16th, got the Air Max 90 Mars Landing. Now, I don't know if this is gonna do as, as good as the Moon Landing did, because the Moon Landing was fine, and they had the 3M all over the shoe. This thing's still going for crazy money, but um, I, I don't, I don't know, like, they, they all right. I'm not gonna say they trash, I ain't gonna say they cash, they just all right. It's a pad. And then on the 16th, we got the region exclusive Yeezys. Now I'm pretty sure the clays are coming out in the United States, but it's not on the list. But um, for Europe, we got the TRFRM. I don't know what, the, what that stands for. But um, that's coming out on the 16th in Europe, and then in Asia, we got the hyperspace. Um, like, I like the see-through sole on the TRFRMs. Um, the other than that, it's just really just a basic shoe. And I like the uh, I like the color of the hyperspace. I just don't like the bottom of it. Um, and the clays, I mean, I do like the clays, but... They ain't on the list. I'll put them up here if they still coming out. I try to do some more um, research if they still coming out in America on the 16th. But um, yeah, that's gonna do it for this video. Make sure that y'all leave a like if y'all like the video. Just like if you dislike the video, comment down below if you're looking forward to any of these shoes. Share the video, tell a friend, tell another friend, tell another friend to subscribe because we on the road to 1K. And it's your boy, your bathroom superstar signing out. Y'all be breezy. All right.